Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. With fall approaching, that means the holiday season's approaching, and it's my favorite time of year when Chanel comes out with their holiday sets. I am so excited for this year's holiday sets. I have the sneak peek of it. Someone sent it to me, and I wanna share it with you guys because I tried looking online forever, and I couldn't find it, and then a sale associate sent it to me, and I am so excited to share it with you guys. So if you guys want to see all the goodies, then please keep watching. If you can see, I had a major obsession last year with the holiday sets. I think I got almost every single one. This one right here is from 2021. This was the lip gloss trio one. And this was 2021's holiday set. And then this one was 2022. And then 2022 also had a white one. I love this one, actually. This, this is the Lip and Fragrance set. And then 2022 also had this one as well. It came with a travel um, Mademoiselle perfume. I didn't spray any perfume today. Mm. And I haven't even used this. I gotta start using this. And then it also comes with a little chapstick. So yeah, let's talk about this year's because I'm sure you guys already seen these videos of last year's and the year before that. So let's get right into it. I'm going to show you the pictures that I was sent. Also, if you guys want to stay up to date when things will be launching and if you guys want to be notified, make sure you guys are following my Telegram group chat. I will link it down below. Basically, it's a group chat where I just post all my favorite finds, sales, coupon codes, um, when things launch, things like that. And it's so much easier than Instagram because some people don't have their notifications on. And a lot of the times, at least last year, a lot of people missed when it launched on Chanel's website because they just didn't check Instagram. Telegram is so much better because you get a notification to your phone directly. It's like a text message and there's no comments. So you're not going to be getting back to back messages. I turned the comments off. It's only me posting if I find something that I think you guys will love like Dior coupons or when the Chanel items are going to launch, things like that. So make sure you guys are joining my Telegram group chat and also make sure you follow my Instagram if you don't want to download Telegram app. So this year sets there, it looks like it's a blue bag and then they also have like a white one one that looks like gold iridescent in it looks very pretty the blue one looks like it has some gold iridescent also um, it's hard to tell by the photo but the first one is a sight to see it's called a sight to see gift set will include this mascara right here and a waterproof eyeliner I don't have the eyeliner and it will retail for $88 which is pretty affordable there are some that range between like $100, $112 this year. And I personally really like this mascara. A lot of high-end mascaras I feel like aren't really worth the money, worth the hype. But I think this mascara is a really nice one. I did a full review on it. Also with the primer that it came with last year. I really love this mascara. I think it's really worth it. The next one is called Absolute Allure. And it comes with their Nor Allure Nor. I have no idea if I'm pronouncing anything correctly. So please don't hate on me. And then it comes with their Rouge Allure. So it looks like it is a mascara and a lipstick and this one will retail for $99. Also, it comes with a blue and like gold iridescent bag. The next one is called Always Brilliant, which is the classic, the three trio glosses. By the looks of the picture, it looks like it's the three shades that they always include every year, which are these three right here. They are really beautiful glosses. They are in the shades 712, 119, and 722. They do this one every year. I feel like my only complaint on this one though, it retails for $113 where every year it's a hundred dollars so they raised it thirteen dollars i'm gonna double check that before i say that last year it was 101 so i just wanted to double check before i said something and then i was incorrect but yeah so it went up twelve dollars which is kind of frustrating because every year it's always been a hundred bucks so now it's 113 um but it is the lip trio it is these three that it comes with blue chanel bag and it looks like blue and gold iridescent um i think it's pretty from the picture I don't think it's nicer than a classic red. I just feel like red is so signature because it's a holiday gift set. So, and I feel like it's just so classy, especially because you can turn them into crossbody bags like I did with this one right here. So this one was from 2022. This one I had to install the D rings right here. If you guys want to know how I did that, I have a video linked on it from last year. I will post it down below if you guys want to check it out. 2021, it did come with these little flaps right here where you can just insert the 
the chain right there last year unfortunately didn't have it but honestly I kind of like the d-rings there I think it looks a little bit more elegant I personally loved last year's I just love the gold iridescent with it so by the looks of the picture it looks more similar to the 2021 I don't know just by the picture I feel like it looks more like 2021 where it just looks like a navy blue with like gold iridescent which it's fine I just I don't know I love the classic red I think the red is just so elegant um but who knows maybe they'll be releasing more a lot of the sales associates don't even know that much they just get like pictures and they don't really know that much details at least from what I'm told I don't know if that's true um I want to work at Chanel. I think that's such a cool job to work there, especially if you just love beauty and makeup. The next one is called Easy Come Easy Glow. It is a balm essential transparent and a rose cocoa balm. So it looks like it's a highlighter and like a little balm. Um, super cute. It retails for $97. And this one is also a new bag. It looks white and gold iridescent right there. It's hard to tell by the photo. The photo she sent me was very pixelated as well. So it's not very clear. I don't know. I feel like it has a gold iridescent. Again, it's reminding me a lot of the 2021. Um, it doesn't really have like um, a tweed material like it kind of just looks like this but white with gold um, so again that retails for $97 I am mistaken for something really quick I was reading the wrong number so a sight to see right here is actually $78 it is way more affordable than the other ones <laughs> I read 88 that's just like the style number possibly but it's actually $78 I'm dumb. I apologize. And then also the absolute allure was $92. Then the last one on here is On The Go Moisture, which retails for $82. Comes with that. I have no idea how to pronounce that. El Hul Camila and a Rouge Cocoa Balm for $82. And again, it has the white bag with like gold iridescent. I just looked up what the Camilla, the La Hul Camilla is, and it's a hydrating oil for your nails. And then it comes with a balm. I don't think that one's really worth $82 in my opinion, but if you were someone who's like me and just likes collecting them, it's a good price just to get the bag and turn it into a crossbody bag. You definitely want to get one of the more affordable ones, which $82 is the second affordable one, and then a sight to see is the most affordable one, which is $78. So yeah, these are all five new of the sets that are going to be releasing soon. There is no date on them yet. I'm expecting if sale associates are getting it already, I'm thinking it's going to be... October. Um, some people think that's a little too early. They think it's going to be more November, but I just feel like it's going to be a little bit earlier because if they're getting these pictures. Um, I know last year when I kept messaging my sales associates, I was like, when are they coming in stock? And she goes, we literally have no idea. We didn't even get the flyer, the pictures of them. And I was like, okay. And then once she got the picture, it launched a week and a half later. Don't quote me on that, but I just feel like it's definitely going to be somewhat soon, especially if they are getting pictures. What do you guys think of it? Do you love it? I obviously I'm going to buy them I think what I'm going to buy I'm probably going to buy the absolute allure because I've never tried either one of those products which is the nor allure nor and the rouge allure again if I'm pronouncing anything wrong I don't want to see hate comments okay I know I cannot pronounce things so it is what it is. So I think I may do that one um, just to get the blue. And then I kind of want to get one of the other ones just to get the white one. So I probably would get the highlighter one and the balm because um, I don't really put nail oil on my manicures. I mean, I get my nails done. I don't really put any oils on it though. I don't know. I just feel like if I'm going to get the white bag, I think I would want the Easy Come Easy Glow. So at least it has a highlighter and a colored balm um, because... I like colors because um, I did get the balm from Chanel in one of these gift sets and I haven't used it at all. I think I got two of them, one that came with the Coco Mademoiselle perfume and the other one that came with the hand cream, which I love the hand cream. Kind of disappointed that none of them have the hand cream this year. I thought it would because the hand cream is just a staple in Chanel, I feel like. I love it so much. I did a video reviewing the chanel one and the dior one and chanel just won in my opinion i love it it's so good so i'm a little disappointed they didn't include it i'm also really disappointed they raised the three lip gloss trio everything in this world is getting expensive i understand that but when you have something for the same price multiple years in a row it's a little frustrating even if it's only 12 dollars. i mean 
$12 is $12. We work hard for our money and $12 um, can buy a Chipotle or something. Like, you know what I mean? So it's a little frustrating. I'm definitely not going to be getting that one, especially since I already have the three trios and I actually have this set twice because I ordered it in 2021 and 2022. Um, I want to start using it. It's so bad that I haven't really used a lot of it. I just feel like they're such like collector pieces. I'm I'm such a loser. I feel like they're collector pieces where sometimes I'm scared to use them because I don't want to waste them. I don't want to use it up. I want to savor it. Um, but I don't know. I have a lot of it still from last year that I haven't used. So I think after this video, I'm going to go ahead and open everything up and go through all the products and actually use it. So let me know if you guys want a video on that, me just like opening all the products and that would be fun to just see all the goodies. So that is the wrap of 2023 holiday gift sets with Chanel. We don't know if more is going to be coming out because the Coco Mademoiselle perfume travel travel case and the balm was a new one. Like that came out, I think in January or December. It was not in the original launch with all the other ones. That came out totally last. My sales associate told me that she had no idea that that one was coming out. I was lucky enough to get it on Chanel's website. I ordered it immediately when I saw it. Make sure you guys are following my telegram group chat. That is where I'm going to be posting when everything comes back in stock. It is so much quicker than Instagram, especially if someone who doesn't have their Instagram notifications on telegram, you get a notification to your phone, like a text message from me. So I will post it right in there when they're available. Um, you guys know I am on top of it all year. Last year, I was literally posting it every second. It was back in stock. I am constantly checking the website multiple times. So yeah, that concludes the end of today's video what do you guys think do you guys like this year's setup um are you happy about the price increase with the lip trio what do you guys think i'm so excited to hear your opinions um thank you guys so much for watching and i'll see you guys in the next video mm -hmm.